News Extra. If you're looking for something new to read or need to refresh the books on your shelves, you won't want to miss the Guam Public Library book sale happening this week. With us is Frank Affigui, who will give us all the details on this sale. Uh, Frank, welcome to the show. Yeah, thanks for having me back. So you're the program director uh, at the library? No, program coordinator, yes. Oh, program yes. coordinator. Mm -hmm. All right, it's different. Directors, <laughs> they get paid a lot more money. Okay, uh, so... You know, now that we have access to every book in the world on our phone, mm -hmm. that's okay, but sometimes you just got to love the smell of opening a book and turning those pages. Yeah, licking your finger and turning yeah. and smelling it. Yeah. You, you can't beat that. And so you guys have the book sale coming up. Tell us about it. Yeah, well, you know, we haven't had it in the past couple of years because, like, we, you know, some natural disasters are happening. Right. So, but this year we're having it, you know, so right after, because actually this week is uh, library week. Oh, so okay. we're celebrating that we had a proclamation signing on Friday, and uh, Library Workers Day is on Tuesday, and then our books will be on Wednesday. Uh, so it's going to be from Wednesday to Saturday, from okay. 9, 9 to 4. Uh, so what kind of books can people expect to find on there? No, this from paperbacks, you know, children's books, all the way you know, to uh, novels and you know, hardcover. You know, is the paperbacks, the hardcover stuff, yeah, the, the, it's all there, the YA so. things, nonfiction? You yeah, got it the, all. Yeah, usually the children's books are the ones that go out quick. Right. So. Oh, of course, because people go through those yeah. like crazy. You know, once the, the kid is a little older, you don't need the book for the toddlers <laughs> anymore, right? Uh, so, are you guys accepting yeah. donations for the book? Yes, the, you know, we're still accepting donations, uh, okay. and it's you know, as long as the, the materials are in good condition, and you know, they, they can sort it out. Then, you know, since we could actually take from that the donations as well right. to you know, put on our shelves for, you know, for everyone to be able to check the, you know, the item out. Okay, so if a book doesn't sell, sell at the sale, it's just going to go back on the shelves, or how's that no, work? Uh, usually, um, like a Judah Foundation, that will give us a call. Okay. Because they, you know, they assist the outer islands. And also, uh, I guess there's a teacher uh, from the Philippines that was inquiring about, you know, like after the book sale as well. Okay. Uh, so the sale's coming up. It's on the 11th to the 14th, and you guys are open Saturday. I know that's a relatively new thing. Yeah, we just opened up again after closing for like four Saturdays, okay. you know, for the uh, cost-cutting measures that were right. imposed. So, you know, it's good to be back open again. So we're back to our regular, you know, our regular schedule where we're open for Monday, or in again, you know, Monday to Thursday from 9 mm -hmm. to 4, 5.30. Friday, we're close to the public, but that's not going to affect the book sale because our book sale is in the garage area. Oh, okay. So it's not yeah. in the library. Yes. So mm -hmm. business hours, it will be closed, but the sale yes. will still go mm -hmm. on. Yeah, okay. on Friday. And then Saturday also from 9 to 4. And I know that you guys, uh, aside from the sale, you are trying to introduce some new things at the library. you have anything else coming up that you want to yeah, mention? Yeah, well, the whole month of uh, April is Amnesty Month. Okay. So it's a time when, you know, someone can restore their privilege, you know, borrowed privileges. And they can, if they didn't return the item before April, and they turn it in during April, they can waive all the fines. You okay. know, some of the uh, book is in good condition, you know, the material. So you're not going to send the marshals after them or uh, anything? No, no. No. Even though they're just next door, but okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that's interesting. You're just trying to get people back to the library because yeah. I know people. You know, there's other ways to get information in books. Yeah, true. But you know, like we said earlier, you know, it's nothing more than opening a, a book itself and you know just sitting back and relaxing instead of just swiping or right. You know. <laughs> and then turn it off, you're done. I have a book marker and everything. Exactly. Uh, fantastic. So the month, obviously a busy month for you guys with the book mm -hmm. sale coming up. Again, if people want more information, can they call you? Yes, they can call you know, uh, the library at 475-4751, 52 or 53. Fantastic. Frank, thank you so much. Thank you so much, too. All right, so do not miss the...